What's up everybody, it's your boy Cooper here. Today I am playing The Walking Dead. Now there's a few things I need to say about this game. Uh, one, I've played it already. Um, very fun game. I love it. Two, um, I won't be able to record for a few days um, after today. So, this is, I'm going to be playing pretty much exclusively The Walking Dead up until I have the chance to record again. Um, so, the next few videos will be just The Walking Dead. Um, not much really else to say. Let's just get into it. The Walking Dead. Um. Well, I reckon you didn't do it then. Oh, um. Uh, uh, um. Why do you say that? Why do you say that? You know, I've driven a bunch of fellas down to this prison. Lord knows how many. Usually it's about now I get the, I didn't do it. Uh. Oh, what do you say? And what do you say? I say, yep, I know you didn't. Okay. Is there a review mirror? Okay. Why are you looking at me like that? Face a little bit. You being a making boy and all. Uh, so you're from Macon? You're from Macon, then? Yep. Came up to Atlanta to be a city cop in the 70s. Picked up on that. Always wanted to work a murder case. Like that senatorial mess you got yourself mixed up in. With all due respect. A real shame. Oh. That is. Hell, the whole family used to be regulars at your folks' drugstore right in downtown. Still there? Sure is. Good. Any of that seem important to you? Yeah, oh well, yeah, I thought it was looking at the shotgun. Shuts up. Sit in this seat and pay too much attention and you'll drive yourself crazy. I got a nephew up at UGA. You teach there long? Going on my sixth year. Was. You meet your wife in Athens? You want to know how I see it? Uh... No. I got that much choice? Sure don't. <laughs> Regardless, could be you just married the wrong woman. Hey, 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 fuck you. <sighs> oh, whoa. Come You'll on. have to learn to stop that. worrying about things you can't control. Oh? There's a helicopter. Um, I'm driving this man once. He he was the worst one. He was wouldn't he? stop going on about how he didn't do it. He was an older fella, big soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses. And he just wailing back there. Says it wasn't him. Crying and snotting all over right where you're sitting. Nice. Then before long, he starts kicking the back of the seat like, like a fussy baby on an airplane. And I tell him he's got to stop. That's government property, and I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. Oh. So he stops, and having exhausted all his options, he starts crying out for his mama. Mama, it's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. Man. Man? <laughs> Not even close. They caught the fucker red-handed, stabbing his wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. 
He sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. Oh shit. It goes to show. People Ooh, often go mad when they believe their life is over. Oh, I got another good one for you. Do you? Do this you? one's a little bit less depressing and a bit more hilarious if I do say uh, so. Uh, oh I shit! Other time. Oh, oh, oh. That was really loud. I forgot about that. Oh shit, it's caught open. Officer! Officer! Hey! Hey, officer! Oh, Are you alright? I'm still cuffed back here! Um. Oh. Damn it. Uh. Oh, here, here. Oh, that's a very easy one to kick through. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Yeah. I need to drag myself oh. out that window. Okay. Okay. okay, come on. I need to drag oh. myself out that Dude. window. Dude. Uh, wait. Look at door. Use the mouse wheel or. Sl okay. Okay. I think I got too close to the door. Cause I remember seeing a, a second option just there. I don't know what it is though. Oh. Uh, blood's growing out of his lean knee. Just shotgun right there. Hey, what's this? Shotgun shell. Oh, look at the leg. Can I take the shotgun? The officer's shotgun is over there. Yeah, yeah, can I take it? Can I take it? Why would he have needed that? Why would he have needed oh, that? Oh, 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 oh. Forgot the one and two thing. <laughs> Looks empty. Yeah, you got a shell? No, no. It'll be easier to carry with these cuffs off. Right. <laughs> Hello? Officer? Yeah, officer. Hello? Uh, um. Ooh, keys. It's unlock, unlock, unlock. Shit. I dropped them. <laughs> My God, look at its skin. It's just turned green. Right, unlock, unlock. Come on, unlock, unlock. Officer? <laughs> Fucking hell. Uh, uh, holy shit! Okay, okay, yep, yep, yep. Oh wait, go the fuck away, go the fuck away. What the fuck are you? Go the fuck away, go the fuck, oh. Shotgun! Get away from me! Shotgun, shotgun, shotgun. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Right, 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 right. Aye! For oh, fuck's sake! Fuck's sake, fuck's sake! Don't make me do this! Officer, go away! Oh, okay. Officer, are you alive? Here. Help! Go get someone! There, there's been a 
They're shooting! Um. Oh, 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 what's over here? What's over here? Okay, there's more. There's more. Ah! Ugh. For fuck's sake. Go, 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 go. There's another one. Go, go, go. Move. Game is suffering a bit. We're safe, we're safe. Hello? Anybody? Right. Okay. Um, what's this? Tea set. Let's have a look at this. I'd fill one of those teacups with some bourbon if I could. Maybe it's put some bourbon inside. No ladder. I'm not getting up there anyway. This leg the way it is. Uh, yeah, you're right, you're right. Hello? Any there? Hell! Anybody up there? No. Okay. Alright, let's see if we can get inside this house. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it seems like we can get in. Okay, okay. All right, let's look in I first. If anybody's home. Or you can just do that. Hello? I if anybody's home. All right, all right. Let's just open a door. Open a door. Hello? Anybody home? I need a little help. Hello? I don't think anyone's home. I think we're allowed to in then. Those are the laws. Coming if no in. one's home, we're allowed in. Don't shoot, okay? Hello? I'm not an intruder. Or one of them. Oh, this blood. That's a load of blood. These people might need more help than I do. My god. Oh, coloring book. Football. Football, 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 football. It's fake. Damn. Oh, answer machine. What are you doing? Three new messages. Message one, left at 5.43 p.m. Hey, Sandra. This is Diana. We're still in Savannah. Uh, Ed had a little incident with some crazy guy near the hotel, so we had to get him back to the ER and have it checked out. Anyway, he's not feeling well enough to drive back tonight, so we're staying an extra day. Thanks so much for looking after Clementine, and I promise we'll be back in time before your spring break. Message 2. Left at 11.19 p.m. Oh my god, finally. I don't know if you tried to reach us. All, all the calls are getting dropped. They're not letting us leave and aren't telling us anything about Atlanta. Please, please, just leave the city and take Clementine with you back to Murrieta. I've, I've got to get back to the hospital. Please let me know that you're safe. Message 3, left at 6.51 a.m. Clementine, baby, if you can hear this, call the police. That's 911. We love you. We love you. We love you. Right, okay. Daddy? Huh? I 
change of daddy. Footsteps over here. Uh, here? Is that where I came from? Oh, it is. Oh, shit. Hello? Hello? You need to be quiet. Damn. Don't be rude. Maybe a killer, but shit, don't be rude. I am. Um, uh, are you okay? Are you okay? I'm okay. They tried to get me, but I'm hiding until my parents come home. But it sounds the things that might be a while. What's your name? What's your name? I'm Clementine. This is my house. Hi, Clementine. I'm Lee. Uh, how, how old are how you? How old are you? Eight. Eight? And you're all alone? Yes. I don't know where anybody is. How old are you? I'm, uh, 37. Okay. Okay. <laughs> where are your parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Where the boats are? Uh, are you safe? Are you safe? I'm outside in my tree house. They can't get in. That's smart. See? Can you see me? I can see you through the window. <laughs> oh, shit! Okay, 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 Bitch. okay, okay, Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> oh, oh. Lad. Fuck you. Beat a fucking ass. Beat a fucking ass. Fuck you. Oh, I, th I thought I took an eyeball. <laughs> Man. Hi there. Did you kill it? Uh, yes. Yes. It's okay. I think she was a monster. Think? Uh, I think so, too. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah. I want my parents to come home now. What has she been eating? I think that might be a little while. You know? Oh. Look, I don't know what happened. But I'll look after you until then. What should we do now? Uh, look for help. Look for we help. We need to find help before it gets dark. Yeah, it's not safe at night. All right, let's go. Stay close to me. <sighs> Say bye bye to your house. All right, where are we going? You got any bourbon in there? All right, um. Okay, I assume we're going off this way then. Um, all right. Yeah, no, there's just, just, oh, there's people here. There's people. Uh, oh, man. I ain't never getting home to mama at this rate. This sucks. Oh, it's hot dish night. Hot dish night? It fucking sucks. You're never gonna get your mama. What? What's the matter? Should I stay? What? I don't want to sleep in the treehouse tonight, but I don't know if I should leave. What if my parents come home? Um. Uh, they won't. Um. I won't leave you alone. Let's go somewhere safe that's close, okay? 
That's a good idea. Yeah, sure. Hello. Hey, man. Holy shit. Don't eat us. We're not gonna hurt you. Yeah. Thought for a second you and the little one were both gonna give us the chomp. Yeah, because they can talk. Um, we're looking for we help. Need help. Are you trying to get out of here? Because you should be. Those things are all over the damn place. I haven't seen anything as gnarly as this neighborhood since downtown Atlanta, 15 miles back. I'm Sean. Sean Green. Lee, this is Clementine. I'm Chet. We shouldn't be out in the open like this. How about you help us clear the way, and we'll take you and your daughter out of here and down to my family's farm. It should be safer there. I'm not a dad. I'm... Um, I'm, I'm, I am, I am her babysitter. Her babysitter. Her parents are out of town. Let's get going. Staying put for too long is a mistake. What do you want to do? I... We have to leave. The monster's coming. We gotta go. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Go, 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 go. Quick, let's go. Come on, come on, come on. Move it. Oh yeah, we have to start late. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. Why aren't you helping? At least you're doing something. Come on. As babysitters go, I'd say your parents owe you a tip. Amen. That was a little too close. You always got shit. Hey, Sean, I'm gonna run on home. My mama's gonna be in a snit. No sweat, man. I'll catch you tomorrow night. It was nice to meet you both. Yeah. Look, Chet. Don't get punched. Thank God you're okay. I was worried it'd be bad here, too. Been quiet as usual the past couple days. Old Brecken down the way thinks his mare's gone lame, but that ain't nothing new. I wouldn't have made it back without Chet. Well, I'm glad you took him with you then. You've brought a couple guests. The boy's a lifesaver. The boy's a lifesaver. Glad he could be a help to somebody. So it's just you and your daughter then? Oh, not his daughter. He's the babysitter. Honey, do you know this man? Yes. Okay then. Well... Looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. Yeah. Uh, yeah. It's not doing so good. I can help you out. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You, take a seat up on the porch and I'll go see what I have. Uh, what about Clementine? What's she going to do? Stand there, okay. Let's have a look. Yeah. This is swollen to hell. Um, it hurts like it hell. It hurts like hell. I bet it does. What did you say your name was? Uh, it's Lee. It's Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. Uh, How'd this happen? Um, jumping a fence. Jumping a fence. Running from something? Just like everybody else. What type of danger has the girl seen? Uh, she's safe she's now. She's safe now. You're serious about taking care of her then? Yes. What choice is there? Yes, yes. House is full up with mine. We got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. You and your daughter are welcome to rest hey. there. Hey, babysitter. I didn't catch your name, darling. Clem Clementine. Can't imagine what you've been through, Clementine. Um... 
looking after her until we uh, find her parents. Hey, Dad. So I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we gotta reinforce the fence around the farm. That doesn't seem necessary. I don't know what you saw on TV or heard on the radio, but there's some serious shit hitting the fan. I don't think anyone knows how big it is yet. Your son is right. Your son's right. You're gonna want to fortify this place. Stuff like that doesn't happen around here, Sean. Dad, I'm serious. Lee, come on. Tell him what you saw out there, man. Um, okay, um, 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 this one. chased by a couple of dead people. Well, do what you think you should. We got plenty of chores as it is. Lee and those folks in the barn can help out in the morning. We gotta do it. Really. I already said okay. Well, I'm all done like it. here. It should start to feel better tomorrow. Thanks. And if your leg gets hot or the swelling doesn't go down, you're probably dealing with an infection. What do we do then? We'll probably just have to shoot you. <laughs> We'll clean it, redress it, and you'll be fine. Okay, that'd be preferable. There's blankets and such in the barn. We'll be seeing you bright and early. Come tomorrow, which way you think you're headed? Towards making, I suppose. Where he's from. All right, then. Oh, there's the other family. It smells like... Uh, 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 uh you know, manure. manure. Manure? Like when a horse plops? Just like that. I miss my mom and dad. I bet, Clem. How far is Savannah? Pretty far. Oh, okay. have been his wife hey get up <sighs> what up there I'm itchy well you slept in a barn little lady lucky you don't have spiders in your hair <gasps> but I bet your daddy scared them all away huh I'm uh, not her dad name's Lee I'm Kenny dad we're but... in no offense there's a tractor and everything we better get gonna... going, or we won't hear the end of it. He's not gonna question. That's my boy, Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. Duck? Doc? Yeah, nothing bothers him. Like water off a duck's back, you know? That's a valuable treat lately. No kidding. But frankly, I think it's because he's dumb as a bag of hammers. Dad! But he makes up for it with enthusiasm. The word is you were on your way to Macon. My family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. Dude, fuck it, why sure, not? Sure, we'll tag along. It's a plan, then. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And, uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build a fence. Yeah? Well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool! Duck and I will hop to it. I can keep an eye on your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. Right. So as I was saying before he kept interrupting, He's not going to question the fact how I said, I'm not her dad, and then, uh, just carried on. You have such pretty hair. It gets sure. lots of tangles. Checking on everyone you've met so far, okay. Hello. Are you having a nice time with Katya Clementine? Yeah. Okay. That's good. Checking on, what's his name from again? Kenny. Hey there, uh, Kenny. Uh, need any help? Need any help? No, I think I got it. 
Do you need any help? What do you mean? I mean in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? Uh, no kids. Nah, nah, no, no kids. Would have liked one then. You know. Uh, how's your son how's doing? How's your son doing? Good, I think. Kachi's got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds and... Christ. Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. But we're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. What's your plan? So what's your family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Government will start handing out shots and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could hop on my boat, I guess. You've got a boat. I'm a commercial fisherman, catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting and paying. Katya wouldn't be wild about it, but the boat's not that bad. See ya. Jesus, you lads are full of conversation. Or at least you are Lee. Okay. Um, do you have to go to the bathroom or I just anything like right that? here? Lee, the young woman can take care of herself. Yeah. Okay. There we go. Hey there, girls. You two actually look relaxed. I think we're doing just fine. Clementine was just telling me about first grade. Oh. Uh, how was that? It's easy. Well, yeah. <laughs> so you're good. Anyway, it's almost like we didn't see people eating each other for the past three days. It's peaceful here, huh? Now what do you so, do? So, uh, what do you do when corpses aren't walking around? I'm a veterinarian back in Fort Lauderdale. Like Herschel here, except more with dogs and cats and uh, not horses. What is it that you do, Lee? Um, I used to teach up at the University of Georgia. Yes. We need to hope that we can go back to our jobs soon, Lee. Back to normal. It can't stay like this. Uh. No, I used no, to. I used to. I was let go a little while back. Well, that's too bad. Well, I hear people always clamor back to college after a big disaster. People don't want to die ignorant, I guess. Well, I murdered someone, so. How did you handle getting through the city? Kenny just drove. We passed so many people that needed help, and we just passed people over some. Just, just... Uh, it's okay. It's fine. You don't have to say anymore. I want to go home tomorrow. But even then, I can't take away the things we... The things Doc went through. Don't you want to go back to the moment before you knew about all of this? Uh... Who wouldn't? Anybody in their right mind would. Families and barbecues and beers with good friends. All of those things. Those are the things we live for, right? With those gone, what's the point? Back in a bit. Okay, Lee. Right. Hmm. Where am I going? Where am I going? Uh, am I going back in here? Um, uh, no. Okay. I have to go around the back. Yep. Hey, Duck. How you doing, Duck? Good. I'm going to drive the tractor. I'm the foreman. Lift with your back, Sean. All right. Look at tractor. You know how to drive it? Sure don't. I can give you a hell of a critique of the U.S. Farm Bill, though. I'm good. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's talk to Sean. Hey, Lee. Need a hand? Need a hand? That'd be great. If you could cut those two bites to length, that sure speed things up. Che, okay. My dad doesn't know how bad it is. No, he doesn't. I saw a guy in Atlanta kill a kid. A boy. Just shot him right in the face. Was he one of the walkers? Was the boy one of the walkers? I don't even know. He was either attacking the guy or asking for help. He didn't even hesitate. He just turned, put the barrel of the gun right between the kid's eyes, and pulled the trigger. You don't see things like that. It's not like in the movies. They don't fall like you think. Did you have to do it? 
<laughs> Do what? Kill. Have you had to off one yet? Oh. Uh. uh it will say the second one. Bastard. Poor girl's brains in. Whoa. Uh, I couldn't do that. I'm just glad we're getting this fence built. Dad just wants to keep the family safe and thinks inviting people in is a bigger threat than whatever's out there. How about yours? How's your family? Uh. We'll just say the first one. My brother and parents are in Macon. I hope. Oh man, I hope so too. Maybe it's not too bad there. That's probably all I need cut for now. Thanks. You're welcome. And Sean, thanks again for the ride. No problem, Lee. Couldn't leave you behind. Anyway, when you see my dad around, he might want some help in the barn. All right. Let's go to the barn. Bye bye, duck. Bye bye, Sean. Right. Oh. Hey. Hello. Need you help? Need you help? You should know that if you weren't leaving with Kenny today, I wouldn't stand for your lack of honesty last night. Huh? I'm not sure I follow. How'd you get out of Atlanta? Uh... On foot? Uh, on foot. I headed south and hoofed it out of there. That's a long walk. Uh, this farm's a nice plot of land. <laughs> Had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. Never was a plan, having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. Family's important. It's all that matters. You agree with that? Was brought up to, yes. Where's your family now? Parents? Wife? Girlfriend? Uh... Macon. My parents are in Macon with my brother. Well, I hope they're all right. But now you've got this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? Uh, second one. I was being attacked and she came to my rescue. Hmm. Can I give you a piece of advice? Sure. Sure. I don't know who you are or what you did. But you better become a better liar, and fast. Let's say things don't get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. You're gonna have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're gonna make it. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're gonna be in trouble. So whoever you are and whatever you did, keep it to your damn self. But at least you have the common sense to listen to a man giving you advice. Oh shit. Oh Go. shit. I'll get my gun. Why do you take such a long way around? Holy shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh, shit. Alright, no, no. Help the child. Help the child. Help the child. Uh, fuck you. Fuck you. Stick your hands off him. Fuck off of him. I got you. Now try it. Dude. Help me, please. Fuck the, the duck start the fucking thing and just decide to run him over. Get out. Get the fuck out of here! I'm sorry. Sorry? Your son is alive. You don't get to be sorry. And you! You didn't even try to help. Yes, I did. I was worried about the boy. 
Mm. Yeah. But you weren't worried about that. Please. Just go. Get out and never come back. Alright, fuck. Got that ride to make it if you want it. Okay. Oh, I took that right. Okay. Well, this is as far as we're going. And it's far enough. Look! Hey there. You friendly? Trucks run out of gas. Damn friendly. Fuck. Oh my god. Oh shit. Where's it gone? Oh yeah. Who are you? Run! Wait. Take risks like this. And we can't just let people die either. When I say that door stays shut no matter what, I fucking mean it. We don't know who these people are. They could be dangerous. Worse, they could have let them right to us. Yeah, we have Where kids. the hell is your humanity? We have kids with us. I see one little girl. And what about Doc? I I have to pee. I'd go out there. Alright, right, just go. In a second. Then just go! Damn, don't shut her. They've got kids, Lily. Those things outside don't care. Maybe you should go join them then. You'll have something in common. God damn it, Lily. You have to control these people. She's an asshole. She's an asshole, that's for sure. That's what it takes. Well, you don't have to be a bitch about it. Holy <laughs> shit. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. He wasn't bitten. He wasn't bitten. Hell, he wasn't. We have to end this now. Over my dead body, we'll dig one hole. No, I'm cleaning him up. There's no bite. He's fine. Don't you fucking people get it? We've already seen this happen. We let someone with a bite stay in, and we all end up bitten. Shut up. We gotta throw him out, or smash his head in. Kenny, stop him! Hey, what do we do about this guy? Um, Dad, it's just a boy. It, it's... Lily, I'll handle this. Your reason with Dad, him. You need to calm down. We reason with him. With the bloody end of an axe handle, maybe. Nobody. I didn't say with Kenny. Boy. Everyone, chill the fuck out. Nobody is doing anything. Shut up, Lily. And you, shut the fuck up. They Jesus Christ. And they will get in here. And none of this will fucking matter. But right now, we're about to be trapped in here with one of those things. What the hell are you talking about? He's bitten. That's how you turn. He's not bitten. Please stop this. It's upsetting him. Oh, I'm upsetting him. Upsetting is getting your... eaten alive. What if this was your daughter? Never would have happened. She's not some snot-nosed toddler, okay? She's United States Air Force. Oh, fuck you and her. I'm gonna kill him, Cat. Just worry about Duck. Lee. Yeah. There's someone in there. It's just locked. Keys behind the counter. Probably. Hey, I'm not the bad guy here. I'm just looking out for my daughter. No, you're just the guy arguing for killing a kid. He's covered in muck. She'll find the bite. Watch. She won't. And if she does, the first thing he'll do is sink his teeth into his mom's face. Then, when she's dead, he'll probably it's just a pounce boy. on your little girl. It's a little boy. I think we can handle him. A little boy? He'll be an uncontrollable man-eater. It's not gonna happen. It is. And we're tossing them out now. 
Uh, no. No! You don't touch that boy! You don't touch anybody! I've got a little girl I'm trying to protect in here, too. You wanna get violent, you old fuck? Well, come uh -oh. on! You better have a plan to kill me, though, because it's me before anyone else in here! <coughs> Oh, for fuck's sake. A lot of you are useless. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Go, 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 go. Yeah! Jesus. Man. Thank you. You okay? <laughs> thank you, thank you. That's great, thanks. Uh, guys? Oh, uh, fuck. Everybody down! Stay quiet! Wow. I gotta get in! Shut up! Like the military. I don't know. Thank God for whatever it is. We almost died because of this bitch and a Richie trigger finger. That was stupid. That was. Uh, uh, Dad! Ah! Ah! Yeah, yeah, what's wrong with him? What's wrong with him? It's his heart. My pills. Um, nitroglycerin pills? Yes, we're out. We've been trying to get into the pharmacy since we got here. Please try to get in there, behind the counter where the pills are. I don't fuck what I want to help him. Through the office. There's probably another entrance, maybe through the office. How do you know that's an office? Uh, educated guess. It doesn't matter. We need nitroglycerin pills. Please get in there. I'll keep an eye on my dad. Everyone else should get comfy and look for anything useful. We could be in here a while. I'm starting to think this drugstore isn't a permanent solution. You're right. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. What do you suggest? We need as much gas as possible so we can all get out of downtown Macon. Fast. Agreed. And I'll head out and get gas. There's a motel not too far from here, out towards the end of Peachtree. I'll work my way towards it and then loop back, siphoning what I can. Um, you're insane. You're insane. Well, it's gotta get done. Plus, I'm quick, and I know Macon. Local? Born and raised. If you're gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie if you get in a tight spot. Hopefully, you won't need it. Cool. Clementine's got the other one. Check in with her and get back here as soon as you can. And you? What's your name? It's Lily. My dad's Larry. Keep a good eye on him. These boys will work on getting you your medicine. That's right. And you? You keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. For now, get some rest. You're a good shot, and I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. Now get him those pills. Fucking Christ. No. Alright, let's talk to... What was her name? Car Carly? Carly. You're a pretty good shot. Well, you don't fuck with a reporter. Especially one that's three days out from her last cup of coffee. Um... What do you... You know what, you, you seem well. to handle yourself pretty well. <laughs> really? I'm a disaster. I can't tell. My news editor was eaten about five feet away from me, and I would have joined her if it wasn't for that dorky guy on watch over there. I'm sorry. She was an asshole, but, you know. Yeah. Uh, that guy saved you? That guy saved you? Yeah. Can you believe it? Those creeps, or, or ghouls, or whatever the hell they are. They were pulling our van apart, and that guy, Doug, just came to the rescue. You can never tell who the heroic ones are gonna be, I suppose. He's kinda cute. In that parent's basement sort of way. Oh. Huh? Huh? Oh, nothing. <laughs> How'd you end up here? We drove up to cover the Cherry Blossom Festival. Real hard-hitting stuff. Sounds worth it. You working on? What are you messing around with there? A radio. I can't get it to work, though. Here. Let me have a look. Um, right. Hmm, nothing. Uh, volume. 
All right. Uh, antenna. All right, he's extended it good. Any batteries? No batteries. There are no batteries in this thing. What now? Do you know that there are no batteries in that thing? Yeah, of course. I, I mean, yeah. No. I can try <laughs> to find some. Needs two. Thanks. I wouldn't even really know what to look for. Uh, probably double A's. Let's talk to Doug. Heard or seen anything? Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? <laughs> I'm not suicidal yet. No, the gate up there is closed. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. Oh, huh. Uh, yeah, let's have a look. Sure. Let's go have a look around. Cool. And we'll keep it down. Don't need to bring them back this way with any unnecessary noises. Okay, okay. Agreed. Jesus. That's a lie. Oh my god. They just eat. As far as I can tell, it's all they care about. They fucking tore him apart. They eat you. And whatever's left comes back as one of them. How the fuck? I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Yeah, I think so too. We better keep it down out of here. Okay. What's this? <laughs> too bad we don't have a way to come out here and watch the news. Would be nice to know what's going on elsewhere. That it would be in rough shape, that's all I know. Um What's this? Did you guys try to get in there and get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. And then a bunch of guys showed up and they tried. Okay. And what happened? I think we know. They're most of who you see wandering around out there. Yeah. Uh It's a combination lock. Right. Hey man, what are you doing? We can't even think about going out there unless the keys are out there for sure. Okay. Oh. Look at the one trapped over there. Better hear uh, this. Huh? Uh, oh shit. What? Do you know that guy? Uh familiar face kind of has a familiar face well, you're from around here huh could be anybody you know they start rotting and get all chewed up and shut up dog look at the uniform though he could have worked at the drugstore and died with keys in his pocket it would take a lot of effort to make it safe enough to go out there and see if he has the keys if we could somehow prove that he worked here, I think it'd be worth it. I'll see what I can find. Uh... Yeah, that's a hasty fortification job over there. Yeah. Uh, it didn't work. It is... Oh, brick. I can't reach that brick. Damn it. Okay. We should think about searching that guy across the street. Yes. Maybe he has them, but who knows if he actually worked here. Ugh. Agenda How'd here. you end up here? Well, I moved here to live with my uncle. He does tech stuff and it just made sense. So you're local. You probably knew the owners of this place. No, not really. I've only been here a couple months and I spend a lot of time. On the computer? No, just doing my own thing. What about you? Uh, grew up here. I grew up here. Been trying to get home since the day I came back. Oh, so you probably knew the owners then? Yeah, I did. Good people. Yeah. Okay. Let's uh go back inside. Let's head back inside. Okay. I don't think there's anything we can do. <laughs> okay. Um. Look at this. Greeting cards. No, I'm sorry to hear your loved one was eaten by the living dead cards. 
How did I not have those carries, man? Oh, battery. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme. That's one battery. Need a we second can't one. let anything happen to Ducky. I know, hun. Uh, I don't remember them very well. Right, alright, let's talk to the, the family. Hey, Lee. You really gave that old man hell. Yeah. We got pushed, you know? You don't have to tell me. I was ready to tear the man's head off. Don't blame anyway, him. We, Kat and I, appreciate your support. Thank you, Lee. How's Duck doing? How's Duck doing? He's okay. It was just a shock. We're lucky as hell nobody got nabbed on the way in here. Little kid. How's she doing? I don't know. She's good, I think. She's good, I think. She's a tough one right there. She's just a little girl, Ken. What were you saying, Lee? She spent days surviving on her own? That's right. Not just any little girl can do that. What's the plan? What's the plan? Hang tight, I suppose. Seems pretty dangerous out there, so we ought to wait for things to clear up. You said your family was from here in Macon? That's right. Where are they? Should we go looking for them? Uh... This. They, uh, own this place. They're uh, gone. Oh, sweetie. Cat. They were good people. I wasn't around much, but yeah, they're dead. You guys all right? Are you guys all right? Oh, we're just fine, considering. How about you, Duck? We've all been through a lot. Lee, you got a second? Sure. What you want, man? Back on Herschel's farm. Yeah. We didn't even try to save him. That blood is on our hands, you know? Uh, it happened fast. It, it was happened fast. pretty fast. I guess. But I can't stop seeing him in my head. We can't kill ourselves over We him. killed that boy. We could have saved him together. We did what we could. Bad things happened. We didn't make a choice that killed John. You think you do when you look back on it. But in a moment, when things are really out of control, you don't have any choice. He's yes. right, he's right. Hindsight is twenty twenty. Try to let it go. Okay. Right. Ooh, candy bar. Oh no, energy bar. Gimme. Um, uh, let's... Oh, another one. Yeah. Maybe... Uh, Duck would want it. Oh, a third one. A third energy bar? Okay. Clementine. Hello. Hey there. Hi. Any word from Glenn? Any word from Glenn? Nothing. Is he okay? Yeah, I think so. You're doing a good job. Can I get you anything? Can I, uh, get you anything? I'm okay. Maybe I'm a little hungry. I'll okay. see about that. Okay. I got some energy berries. We should get to know so, each other. So, um... Are you okay? What? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm fine. I just, uh... I'm good. That's good. Yeah, I think so. Uh, being good is good. Despite the circumstances. Yep. We'll sit tight. Lad. Okay. All right. Uh, give it's that to Clementine. Much, here you go. Thank you. Of course. Check out the ATM. It's not damaged. Glad this place didn't get looted. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um. Do you want the energy bar? Here, I've been finding some stuff to eat. Oh, um, uh, thanks. You're welcome. Are you sure your girl doesn't need it? She's good. I've been trying to keep her fed and watered. You're a good caretaker. Thanks. Right, and... Doc. Doc needs one. We just need to get back there to Fort Lauderdale. It's not much, but here. For the boy. Oh, thanks, Lee. He appreciates it. That's sweet, Lee. I think he's still in shock. What's this? It's all melted now. Ice cream. 
Uh, all right, let's talk to these dickheads. I'm not sure I got your name. I'm not it's sure Lee. if you're Lily. not bitch. My dad's Larry. I was just doing what I had to earlier. Everyone was. You didn't have to call me a bitch in front of my people. Well, you didn't have to threaten a child. Right? It's hard enough to be in charge of people's lives without but some it wasn't dick you, actually. cutting down. And that violence before with my dad, that didn't help. We fucking started it. What's wrong with him? He's got a heart condition. He takes nitroglycerin tablets pretty regularly. I've seen a few bad attacks that he couldn't get over and needed to go to the hospital. Yeah, that's uh, not really an option right now. I'm just trying to keep him relaxed. Ah, <sighs> he's got a temper. He's got a temper. Ah, fuck you. Fuck you. Yeah, he doesn't mean it. It's just that... Yeah? We've got kids here. Families. He and I are a family. And? I'm just saying some people can't handle a temper like that. Hell, barely seems like you can. It's just his way. Don't make him the reason everything's screwed. He's the reason. Where's her mom? Savannah, I think. Oh, you guys aren't together. Oh, uh, no, I'm not her dad. I found in a house when getting out of Atlanta. She'd been surviving by herself. I think the girl's parents didn't make it. Oh. I heard an answering message. They were in Savannah. She was home with a sitter. It wasn't good. Well, she's lucky to have you. You don't fucking know me. You're from here? I work at Warner Robins, the Air Force base. Yeah, I know it. Pilot? Nah, just mechanical admin stuff. I deal with a bunch of shitheads and bureaucrats all day. Sometimes a plane, if I'm lucky. You? I work up at UGA. Uh... Was anyone here when you guys got here? No, this place was pretty wrecked. We pulled a couple of bodies out of the office. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Did you know anybody here? Yeah, the owners, they were, uh, we were close. I'm sorry. We found an older couple in the office. Dad hauled them out in case they weren't really Oh dead. my god. Uh. What do you think about all this? What is there to think? The dead are up walking around, eating people, and turning them into more... more of them. I mean, Jesus. We need to stick together and get through this. I'm gonna get back to him now. Alright, fucking Christ. Let's go in. They're not in there. They were hauled. Oh my god, that's a shitload of blood. I can't. I can't think about them in here. Jesus. Okay. Well, we can look First at this. Aid kit. Or, yeah, you can just talk about it halfway across the room. Uh, what's in here? Luckily, there's nothing I need in here. That's good. Saw this. My parents came in here hoping to survive. But it looks like one of them was hurt. I wonder if it was my dad. <laughs> Trying to be a hero, maybe. Or a protector, at least. Look at Sally. Okay. This door leads to the back alley. Is that where that guy went to? Move palace. What was that? Kane. What's that? This was my dad's cane. He'd zip around here on it from time to time. Was he sick? Nah, he was okay. I actually saw him whoop shoplifters with it. <laughs> this cane's protected this place better than any guard dog ever could. Plus, he knew how to make it look cool. Like you with your hat. My dad gave it to me. See, dads are smart like that. Uh... Hey. Move desk. Better get this door clear, huh? 
Can I help? Yeah, sure. Sure. Here we go. Watch your fingers in the drawers. Yeah, but there's no drawers there. How are you doing? How are you doing? There's no drawers on her side. Yeah, it's not that heavy. How about with everything outside? It's not good. No, it's not. But I think it'll be okay. Okay, here we go. Oh my god! <laughs> the face just pulled. Do you have kids? No. You don't have a family? Uh, what do your parents do? What do your parents do? My mom is a doctor, and my dad is an engineer. Those are good jobs. What's your job? I, uh, teach history and writing and things like that. Like, um, social studies? Yeah, like that. You didn't answer my question. All right, a little further. I'm still not answering it. <sighs> Push. Why don't you want to talk about your family? Do they, like, hate you? Uh, you know what? Just fucking hit her. They call her truth. Because they're dead. Oh, I'm sorry. You didn't know. I'm just sorry for being mean. Look, my family's gone, and I just wish things would have been different. Yeah. Uh, I got in trouble. I okay. got into some trouble, and, and I didn't talk to him for a while. This used to be their store. But let's just keep that between you and me, okay? Okay, because of the trouble? Yeah, that's right. Now, uh, let's get this done. Oh, she's bleeding. Are you okay? I hurt my finger. Is it bleeding? A little. I saw the um, first aid kit. I'll find you a bandage. Saw that over here. Right. Hey, hey, get, get, get your ass over there. All right. All right, Clementine, here you go. Let's have a look at that finger. How? It hurt. Let's see if we can do something about it. Uh, yes, let's put a bandage on. Let's get this cut covered up. Yes, please. There you go. Yeah, what's in the drawer? A... Lee? What? Yeah? What if my parents come home and I'm not there? They'll find They'll, us. They'll, uh, track us down. Don't worry. Yeah, okay. We should keep a lookout. I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. Stay close to me until then, okay? Right, it didn't... It's the remote to my dad's TV. Yeah. Uh, oh, photo. Oh, the family photo. Find um, anything? Oh, hello. Uh, a photo of the family owned the place. It's a photo of the family who owned this place. Might help us track down the keys to the office. I know who you are. You're Lee Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. This is your parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. I paid attention to that trial. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. <laughs> Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? Nope. No, I've been sticking to first names for a reason. Don't give me that face. I'm giving you, you batteries. You seem like an okay guy, and the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of, and look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Good. 
because if this lasts longer than a few days and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. I hear you. I'll just keep it to myself. Uh, thanks. Thanks. Don't worry about it. TV. Maybe a murderer, but I That's like watching TV. I um, okay, we've had already had a look at that. Right, let's check out this. Uh, the keys are on that zombie out on the street. Okay, so let's prove it's a dog then. Exit. She's. Wanna head back into the drugstore with me? Okay. Lee? Yeah? You're not bad, right? I... Uh, why are you asking me that? That lady said you killed someone. Was that because he was one of the things trying to eat you? Be honest with her, no he wasn't. No, he wasn't. Oh. Was he bad? He was. Yeah, I slept with my wife. Alright, um, dog, 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 you're over this way. So looking for more batteries. Ooh, what's in here? Looks like nobody got a chance to donate anything before this all went down. Or maybe it's all been donated before. Did I have a look at this? No, I didn't. Alright, dog. How we doing? Good. Wanna go have a look around outside? Sure, sure, sure. Let's go. Let's have a look around. Okay. Um. Oh, yeah. Show him the remote. Think you can do anything with this? You know what I could do? What's that? What could you do? It's universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. I just hope the power is still on. You can just do that? Well, I memorized all the codes when I was in AV. Let's try. Memorized. You, you, you useful well motherfucker. Well fucking done, Doug. All that dork nonsense might save a life. Who's to say it already hasn't? Look, bright light. That got a few of them to take notice. <sighs> Man, that's like a metaphor, bro. Or like zombies watching TV. All right, you. I got a picture. That guy over there has the keys. How can you be sure? I found this in the office. That boy in the photo worked here. The keys being on him is as good a bet as we can make. Yeah, I agree. We just need to figure out how to get out there and get them. You wouldn't need long, right? Nah. Just a few seconds. Maybe there's a way to distract them and buy you some time. Alright, I don't think there's anything else we could do. Let's go back inside. Let's head back inside. Okay. Right. We'll go talk to Clementine, see if that guy is uh tried talking to her. Uh where's Clement there? Alright. Is he tried talking? How's your finger? How's your finger, Clem? Good. It doesn't hurt so much anymore. Good. That's good. I know I'm not your dad, but if you need anything, I'm your guy, okay? Okay. Same. You're my guy? Oh, no. <laughs> you know. We're gonna try to take care of each other. Yes. Deal. Let me know if you need anything. Okay. okay. Right. Talk to Carly. I've already talked to her. All right, fine. What you want? Hey, Carly. Oh, you ready to head out? Wait, where? Where? Found this a battery. battery should fit the radio. Great, thanks. What? We heading out. Hey to? there. Uh. You ready to head out? You got it. You? Yeah. Yeah. Let's go. Where are we going? Motel, okay. 
before any of these things notice us? Not yet. There's a survivor trapped up there. No way. We gotta go. Now. Listen, I was out here looking for gas. And then, up there in the corner room, I heard crying coming from inside. Who is it? It's a girl. We talked and she got frightened. I was trying to get in and help her and she started yelling and saying I was bitten. I tried to convince her I wasn't and that's when all these guys came out of the forest. A, a couple almost got me. And I ended up hiding in the ice machine. Lucky you. Now let's go. We can't just leave her. Damn right we can. You guys are suicidal. Over a girl. I'm saving her. With or without you. Think about it if it was you. Fine. Let's go save Glenn's damsel in distress. <laughs> Alright. Hey, let's get the damsel. Who's next right there? Oh, zombie there. Uh, Jesus, how many? What fucking are there? Okay, this is the plan. We don't know how hard it's gonna be to get her out of that room. Yeah, it's boarded up. Okay. So we have to kill every one of them in here. Quietly. Noise attracts these things. Now let's let's take off the around. ears. Just chop them off. Um. Oh, 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 give me. I got a pillow. Good luck smothering them to death. That's not really what I have in mind. Alright, peek over. Oh, man. Alright, get down, get down. She's eating something. Don't wanna. So we got that one right there, close. Yeah. Where to next? I don't know. We can probably make it over to the RV. Or down to the truck if we're quick and quiet about it. Okay. Let's go, let's go. I imagine we're not going to be seen, surprisingly. Um, I wonder if there's anything in the pickup. Yeah, have a look. Oh. The move. Uh, I think I found a pretty damn good way to stop these guys quietly. Now we just have to get it quietly. Uh, I want to see what happens if I try to pillow. What are you going to do with that? <laughs> I don't really know. Do you have any tricks for getting into cars? Not without tools, or making a bunch of noise, and none with pillows. Okay. Let's just get out of there. Um. Oh. Get out your gun. But the noise. Just follow my lead. Stay right behind me. Yeah, smother, smother. Did that work? That was sick. Shut up. <laughs> All right. So we're one step ahead now. Okay. Uh. Don't know what that's gonna do. Okay, they'll see it, they'll see. We can get that guy by the wall over there. Oh, push then. Push, push. Go, go. Squish him, squish him. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> now we're out in the open. Oh no, we're back here. I think we need to get those other ones. Um, let me check this back plug. Oh, I never checked the door. That's surprising. Um, okay. Wait. 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 I see the spark plug. 
porcelain inside these things turns car windows to tissue paper. Really? Alright. Uh, okay, buttons weren't work buttoning. Jesus. Why aren't they reacting, bro? Well, entirely. They are, but. Right. I got a screwdriver. That could scramble a brain pretty good. That's exactly what I was thinking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So let's go over here, get closer to that one. Let's head back to that wall. Safe there. Oh, that's what I'm like. I had press the button again. Okay. If I was to do this. No. You have to do this first and then. This big is the prime walker killer. Okay. I should be able to take those guys out when they come around the corner of the RV. Okay, okay. I wasn't supposed to do that. This. You hungry? It's very different to hungry, you die. <laughs> Someone was <laughs> it sounded like he was just beating it off. I hope that girl's okay. <laughs> it just sounded like he was just beating off. Alright. Do that, do that. Okay. Wait for the fucker to get a little closer. And boom. Um, okay. Why did you go straight for the fucking chest? Hello. Alright, right, let's, let's get him first. Oh! <laughs> Dude, where'd your weapon go? Into that ice big sized hole. <laughs> Holy shit. It's cool. Now we've got this. Hell yeah. We got an axe. Two more. That should help. And to get me some extra arms. More arms the merrier. Why don't you guys lag behind just in case this goes to hell? Okay, we'll be right behind you. All right, one, one. Don't say just be sneaky. Yeah, they're not gonna see this one coming. You're not gonna see a man with a fucking axe in his hands. Coming up to fucking slice him up and kill him. Hello. Come on, round two, motherfucker. Round two. Oh my. Rad. Was it though? Was it rad? Uh, hello. I'm chopping open your door. In hello a in there. We're here to help. Let's go, guys. In a minute. If you open up, we can take you somewhere safer. We've got a group in town. No, no, no. Please. She's in trouble. No. Miss, we're coming in. Okay, I'm chopping open your door. <laughs> Hello. Stop, just stop. I'm coming out. You're hurt. Oh, God. I I said stay away. We need to get you help. It's too late for that. Guys, she's been bitten. What? I told you, I said go away. I'm bit. But you wouldn't just leave. Let's calm down. You could be fine. I won't be fine. My boyfriend was bitten. You get sick and you die and, and you come back and you kill anything you can find. You have a boyfriend? What? <laughs> I don't want that. It's not Christian. Please. Just leave me. Please go. Uh, well, if you turn, come what after if us. You turn and follow us back to our group. I know. That was why I was locked away. I can't let this happen to me. You have a gun. So? Can I borrow it? What do you mean, borrow? Give it to me. I can just, you know, end this, and then, and then there's no problem. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Please. I don't want to be one of them. They're, they're satanic. 
I just give it to her. Give it to her. What? You can't be serious. Do it. No! Look at her, Carly. There's no happy ending to this. Okay. Fine. Yeah, put it on the ground instead of handing it to her. <laughs> Thank you so much. I know how terrible this must be. We can't watch this. Let's go. We can't go yet. What? She needs to Why go. Why not? Because somebody needs to pick up the gun. Can't leave it. You two go on. Okay. You sure? Yeah. I'm here with you. with you. You're a good man. Hey, Traveler Motel. Everyone all right? Yeah, we had some close calls, but Glenn is fine and... Well, yeah, we're okay. I've got a few canes of gas for your pickup in the trunk of my car. Good to hear it. And things back here? Quiet. Our friend is still in and out over there. He won't survive any more stress. The next order of business is getting those pills out of the pharmacy. All right. I think what we can do... I, I said I just found that battery. How can I with those things out there? Where the hell is the battery? I haven't seen no damn battery in anywhere. What's it? Oh, battery. <laughs> huh, I wonder if that was there the entire time. Alright, Carly, where are you? Uh, here you are, here you are. I got your battery. Should be able to get it to work now. Get it working? It's still not working? Yeah, I can't figure it out. Let me have a look at that thing. Go ahead. Alright, let's have a look. We've done everything else, so let's look at the back. Is there anything up with the batteries? Bro, you put it in the wrong fucking way. What is he doing? Right. Let's turn it on. I'm probably going to have to do volume again. As the underlying oh, it. continues oh. to spread unchecked, the estimated death toll continues to skyrocket. WABE urges you to stay indoors and avoid any contact with individuals you suspect may have been exposed. The station is okay. In the event of a full... Uh, uh, my, my producer's telling me we have to get off the air. Steve. Uh, WABE wishes you and your loved ones... God bless you all. Okay. Central High Tech State. Paper's a week old. Feels like years. Right. Okay, that's Carly. Alright, let's go talk to Doug. How we doing? Good. Wanna go have a look around outside? Yes. Let's have a look around. Okay. I wonder if I still have the axe on me. Um... Oh, yes. Jump that bitch open. Awesome. Now to distract those things. Um, Carefully. Okay. Open it slightly. It's slightly. Not human sized. Alright, let's get the brick. And I think I can. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Do anything else to break if I wanted to? No, I don't think so. Okay. Those TVs are on, and I'm sure they're making a lot of noise behind that glass. Alright, alright. Break it. Break it. Only one shot, Lee. You've one shot. Nice. Clean. The time. Yeah, yeah, now is the time. Alright, alright. 
Just quickly go. Quickly go. We don't have time. Be careful. Keep an eye out, will you? Hello. Hey, bud. I don't know what happened to mom and dad, but I know if you were there, you would have died for them. So, yeah. I'm gonna assume that's what happened. Did you find them yet? Give me a second. Yeah, shut up, man. Sorry, I wasn't here. I'm sorry I wasn't here. But no one you were to take care of him. That. His legs are broken. Like it matters. Alright. Get chopped. Fuck, he's still alive? Alright. Time to finish the job. Come on. Jesus, how is a sh. Uh, not going through him. Okay. Strong motherfucker. Alright, get the keys. There we go. Holy crap! Run! It's a, well, well, hey, 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 hey. Why did he shout? Run, Lee, run. Oh my god, it didn't close it properly. Oh my god. Man, that was close. You didn't but close we did it properly. It. It's all that matters. Shouldn't have slammed it. I've got the keys. Great. God, you're amazing. Let's get in there. Son of a bitch. Alright, 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 go, go. Keys, 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 keys. That's keys. the door to the pharmacy. Oh my god. We should be able to find pills for Larry in there. Come on, come on, keys. There we go. We're in. Time to find those pills. Oh no. Shit. Oh, oh hurry. fuck. Jesus, that's bright. It's early morning, man. What's going on here? She's a screwdriver in her back. Um, is she going for a stroll? When you hear me honking in the alley, start getting Let's people out of here. You got it. Doug, there she Carly, is. and Lee, you guys make sure our defenses stay up till then. Okay. And Lee, I better take that axe in case I run into any of them on the way to my truck. Here you go. I got doors not locked anymore. Shit. You three, get on it. I'll get back as fast as I can. Stay away from the windows. Yes, yes, stay away, stay away. I gotta have, gotta have, gotta have, gotta have. Go. Hey, Lee. Don't make it through this. You should know that I think you're a great guy. Uh, we'll make it through this. We'll make it through it. We will make it through this. Doug, if we don't make it through this, you should know. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> Fuck you. I should know what? Huh? You said I should know the. <laughs> oh, oh. Are you, are you sure? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh. Oh. Okay, then. Give it time. Can you look for something to stick in between the hands? Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
Pickles. Did you find anything? Nothing. Wait. The window is screwed. Go. Yeah, go. For fuck's sake. I found something. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Stick it in, stick it in, stick it in. That's what she said. Come on, come on, come on. Oh. Oh, fuck. Alright, oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Alright, I'm not gonna lie. We need, we need the ammo person. Come on, come on, come on. Damn! No, get him off me. Oh my god. Let's go! Oh I got done. No. Oh. You little shit you fucking oh, shit. Oh. Get the fuck off of Clementine. What? Oh, no! What? What the fuck? Fingers going through my head. I'm not letting somebody else get eaten today. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Especially a good friend. Thank you, Kenny. God. Jesus Christ. What the fuck's that my old man's problem? Oh, you're gonna be burning the corpse? This is... It's not gonna smell good at all. Good shoot, Glenn. Hey, Glenn. With uncountable severe emergencies in all counties, Georgia's cities and their current level of disaster are as follows. Atlanta, stage nine catastrophe. Augusta, stage I think I need to go. To Atlanta? Yeah. I got friends there. And I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening there. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. Gotta do what you gotta do, man. You gotta do what you gotta do. And I gotta do this. I respect that. You guys be safe. We'll try. And Lee, you know, if this doesn't get better, people are going to give up. Like the girl from upstairs. Are you just gonna let them? You told Carly to give her the gun. Yeah, I did. Maybe you were right. I don't know how to handle something like that. Anyway, see you around. But she was gonna turn anyways, man. Look at that fucking snob in the background. I saw the old man in the background. I saw him. Hey, hey Kenny. Kenny. Close call back there. Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yeah. Thank you. At least we you do. understand that. Hey, about Clementine. Yeah? Earlier I said there's some stuff out there that might screw up a precious little girl like her. You did. Well, I still think that's true. But after what I saw today, I think between you taking care of her and her taking care of herself, you two are going to be just fine. Thanks, Kenny. You got it. 
That's a homie right there. Right. Should I talk to, to her? No? Okay. Oh, Cardi. Hello. How you doing, Carly? I'm okay. You know, considering. I do, yeah. I can't stop thinking about Doug. We couldn't have saved him, could we? I don't think so. It happened pretty fast. I know it's stupid. We just met. And he was such a... It's just that... I think that I liked him. Well, I'm sure he liked you too. <laughs> you better have. Anyway, I'd rather be alone, I think. I understand. Wait, Lee? What is it? How did you choose? We both needed you. You picked me. Uh... We should say this. I was gonna help you both. But you helped me first. Yeah, I did. I just wish we both could have made it, you know? Me too, Carly. Alright. Maybe they want to talk? I'm gonna have a fucking like snob. Snob it. Give me a punch in the but face. You know what? He wasn't. Oh, and then. Hey, Duck, uh, you wanna cool it for a minute? Okay, sorry. I'm sorry, there's uh, not a lot of kids here. No, it's not that. It's. I got grabbed again. I was there, though. You're I fine. fell, and my walkie talkie broke. Glenn had the other one. Oh shit. Oh, I'm sorry. She says she can use it for Thanks. her parents. I know I need to be tough. I'm just sad. I know it doesn't make any sense, but it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. And now they're gone. It's gone. Maybe we can find you another one. I'll just keep this one, I guess. Lee, come here for a second. Fuck you. Let me go deal with this. Oh man, Clementine, another thing. Oh god. What do you want? You like my daughter? Uh, she's fine. She's fine. Fine, huh? Well, just fuck you, Lee Everett. That's right. I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. And you go near my daughter or step on a line once, and so will everyone else. Okay, I know old who man. You are. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, <laughs> you watch your ass. Fucking racist. Hey, Lee, do you have a second? Your dad tried to kill me. My dad would be dead if it weren't for you. But he should have been. That I'm sorry. Doug is dead because of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. We're lucky to have you. I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. Me too. This motor end's pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree with that plan. Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. There are worse places to call home. Yeah, you're right. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. Oh. We don't have light anymore. To be continued. Okay, that's the end of episode one. Next time, The Walking Dead. I thought we'd be fine if we survived the walkers. Never expected they'd starve us out. I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. You don't owe me anything, Carly. How you doing, Clementine? I'm really hungry, Lee. We gotta get food, Lee. Soon. Howdy. I'm Andrew St. John. We're from the St. John Dairy. It's beautiful. I never did thank you for saving Duck from the Walkers back at Herschel's farm. Something's coming, Lee. There's gonna be a war. The Walkers don't worry me as much as the bandits. 
Holy shit. Okay. Okay. Oh, right. Okay, lie to her. Sh what? What? What the fuck did I lie about? I don't know. Who did you. you, you <laughs> Who would you save? Doc or Sean? You 49% of players chose Doc. Okay. Loyalty, side with Kenny. Yeah, uh, we defended Kenny. Gave Irene the gun, although that was her name, the one who, um, the one who was at the motel. You and 45% of players gave her the gun. Who did you save? Doug and Carly. Interesting. I don't remember what I lied about. I was just, I thought I was telling him the God honest truth. <laughs> I don't know. I must have lied. Um, yeah, wow, that's, uh, that's the first episode. Right. Um, so that was uh, episode one of The Walking Dead. So I hope you enjoyed um, the video. Um, if you did, leave a like and subscribe to see more videos like this. Because I want to do more stuff like this. It's fun. So I hope you enjoyed and have a good day.